Hello everyone, thanks for checking out today's video. Welcome to my channel, Me and My Jackets. My name is Chris. Today we are doing a video all about the Patagonia box quilted insulated hoodie. Um, so this is a really versatile kind of everyday do anything kind of jacket. We're going to take a good look at this. I'll tell you all about it, how it fits, some of its features. Um, and we'll even um, put on some other layers with it so you can see uh, what the jacket is, you know, all about. All right. If you're new here to my channel, um, welcome. We talk all about different types of outdoor apparel from base layers to jackets to pants, um, boots, even some backpacks and sunglasses. Um, you can check out my website at meandmyjackets.com where I have tons of information um, lots of fun things there all about outdoor apparel and what to wear when we go out there, right? When we're doing these outdoor activities like uh, hiking, trekking, climbing, snowboarding, skiing, camping, fishing, all that good fun stuff. Um, all these uh, reviews that you will find here on my YouTube channel and the information you have on my website all help to just tell you what these things are all about and hopefully help you to make the right decision as to you know what piece might be right for you. So um, I hope you find all these resources here helpful to you and I thank you for your time and thank you for watching the video. Please hit the thumbs up, the like button if you you know appreciate the videos and you know please subscribe to the channel if you're into this stuff there's a ton of information here a ton of videos for you guys to take a look at and like i said hopefully um, you can find something that'll help you out all right so the patagonia box quilted jacket so this jacket kind of reminds me of another video that i did a while back um, from the Patagonia diamond quilted jacket okay so the diamond quilted jacket had this like diamond pattern stitched into it right this one has square pattern stitched into it very similar um, you know this stitching like this helps to hold the insulation in place which helps you know maintain warmth so um, <laughs> It has a nice look to it. I first saw this jacket actually at a local um, ski shop um, that sold this jacket. Um, so, you know, can you wear this for skiing? Well, yeah, I guess, but it's not the most technical piece. All right, so, you know, a lot of the ski jackets have um, a durable, more durable, uh, water resistant, um, you know, outer fabric um, with a, a membrane like a Gore-Tex membrane or, you know, um, Helly Hansen has their own and Patagonia has H2NO. So there's different, you know, waterproof membranes on those jackets and then they have like powder skirts and all that. Um, this jacket, however, I think would be something that if you were going to take this skiing, might not be something you wear on the slopes as much as maybe what you put on later um, when you're around town or you're hanging around the, at the ski lodge and stuff like this. Um, I think this is just more of a casual jacket, versatile jacket, um, but it is quite warm. It has 100 grams per square meter of synthetic insulation. I believe they call it thermogreen um, insulation. So. Uh, very nice and <clears throat> being Patagonia right Patagonia really prides itself in using a lot of recycled materials and you know things that are great for the environment a lot of their nylon finishes on their jackets are made from uh, recycled fishing nets so you know definitely a very cool company that's very environmentally conscious so <clears throat> this jacket here too has a DWR coating, uh, which means it will repel some light rain, some light moisture, um, but not waterproof in a you know heavy soaking rain. Um, but uh, overall, this is just a really nice jacket. Now I am six foot two, 215 pounds. This is a size extra large. Um, it has definitely some room. It's a regular fit, so there's some room underneath it. But it does have um, these like kind of ribbed bands here on the end of the jacket here on the cuffs. 
on, and on the bottom hem around the jacket, which are very stretchy, but it really helps to kind of cinch up around your waist. So you don't need draw strings and pull cords here on this. It kind of cinches up nice. It has a nice length. Okay, the arms are nice and long. Definitely, um, you know, for movement and mobility, there's plenty of room inside here. And the hood is pretty nice. Um, the hood actually has that same kind of ribbed uh, material that we find here on the cuffs around the outer um, edge, maybe about an inch around the outer edge of the hood, which is nice and stretchy. And then there's the two pull cords, right, which will help cinch, cinch it all up around your face. So you zip it up and it's, it's a pretty nice seal here around your face. Very easy to do too, right, with these two pull cords. Oops. Where am I? Two pull cords right in front of the jacket. Um, it has two pockets here on the sides. Now these pockets are not zippered, all right? They're just open, um, but you know, very easy. Like I said, more casual, um, but they are not, there's no zippers on them. It's just, uh, just two, two open pockets, okay? Nice and warm with the insulation here on the outside. And on the inside of the pocket is actually a nice heavy um, nylon. It's actually two layers of nylon here on the inside. All right. Um, there is a chest um, inside pocket here on the left hand side. And it's, it's small, you know, but it's again just enough to throw something in, some, some money, some credit cards, a small wallet or something will fit in there. Um, and it has a little badge. <laughs> Here on the inside, this says wear it, repair it, hand it along. Patagonia's ironclad guarantee. So kind of a nice little patch there. Um, but yeah, I mean, pretty simple jacket. Now, like I said, this reminds me of the diamond quilted jacket that I reviewed a while back. Um, kind of had mixed feelings about that one. Uh, um, the um, jacket was nice, it fit great, it, again just a kind of casual do anything, go everywhere kind of jacket like this one is. Um, I like this one better simply because of the hood. This has a normal hood. <laughs> the other hood had this like pointed elf thing going on, like, a, like I felt like an elf wearing it. Um, wasn't wasn't too uh, just wasn't my style I guess on the hood it was a good hood I mean I'm sure it'll work I'm sure there's maybe some reasoning for that styling but uh, I definitely like this hood fit a little bit better um, both had drawstrings in the front as well so they are a similar design but they do have some differences um, you know in them. But overall, this is a nice warm jacket. Like I'm sitting here, like I'm kind of cozy warm in this thing. Um, and you know, it looks good, right? It's a nice, decent jacket. Okay, so lastly, I just want to throw on some layers with this so you can see, um, you know, just exactly how much room you have underneath it. But there's definitely some room here. Um, first I have, this is an Arteryx Kyanite fleece. I'm gonna throw this on first um, and fitting this jacket underneath this um, box quilted is no problem at all like definitely definitely have room but what I'm going to do now is this is the Patagonia Alp light down jacket so I'm going to put this on top of my kyanite and then we're going to put the box quilted jacket on top of all this so you'll see how it all fits. So nice uh, warm fleece underneath with a light down jacket on top of that and then the Patagonia box quilted jacket will fit over all of these not a problem. Okay. Um, Nice fitting here, again, might not be um, too willing to put on any more under this than what I have. I think this is absolutely a comfortable, um, you know, size underneath to wear underneath this jacket, but I'm not going to go too much heavier than this. Um, I think this, this fits really nice. 
right? Now I'm comfortable. It's certainly going to be nice and warm. Um, so I just wanted to show you what kind of layers we can put underneath this. So definitely have nice, uh, you know, room. Uh, I'm still, I'm still, you know, still got room under here, but I'm very comfortable. So like I said, I can't see too much more underneath this. All right. So I hope that video helped you out. Um, yeah, this is the, uh, the box quilted um, insulated hoodie from Patagonia. So thank you very much for watching. For more information, you can check out my website, as I said before. And, uh, you know, check out all these videos that I have here for you on my YouTube channel. Use the playlists. I have everything broken down into different categories. So you can help find, you know, navigate and find your way around a little bit easier. Hopefully you can find the video that, you know, you like. Um, most of my videos here um, on this channel, I, I don't like to call them reviews. I call them all abouts because I just think that that's basically what I do. I'm telling you all about the jacket. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked the, the video. Again, please hit the uh, thumbs up. Um, subscribe to the channel if you're into all this stuff. I really appreciate your support. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you back again soon in another video. So take care. Have a great day. Bye.